Hi, everyone. Hello. It says, you're live. <laughs> <laughs> so today, not only Alexander came home from work, but he came with a mystery box. I shouldn't say it's a mystery box, but somebody, Matthew, from, hold on, it said, uh, in Australia, it said like South Australia, he sent us a goodie box, and it's a fairly hefty little box. Hi. <laughs> there's something bakeable in there. So I wanted to, we're going to open it live. Since everybody's waiting for our holiday vlog, now this will uh, <laughs> give you something while you're waiting. Hey, be careful. I, I'll, I won't cut it so close to you guys. <laughs> so what do you guys think is going to be in here? More cardboard. Hopefully not the blood from your thumb. She's cutting recklessly towards herself. Now she's not. No. Recklessly. Like not recklessly. The, yeah. our, our kitchen utensils turn into box opening tools at a moment's notice. It's <laughs> I, I think we've had this conversation before, and a lot of people said that they used it too. This is really well. I wonder when this was sent. Do you see a date on this? We just got it today, so it hasn't been... Did we just get it today, or was it waiting for us? Do you need help with this? Yeah. You were freaking me out. Okay, Abby, I'll hop down for a second. Ugh. She's actually freaking me out opening this box up. I would have eventually There's gotten in there. I was like close to that. I need happening. to, like, be able to stand up and put some weight in there, I think. <laughs> There's all kinds of scariness happening with me. Oh, somebody this. from... Sorry, I can't read that far, but it says from Melbourne, Australia. I can read that. <laughs> yeah, so and... So maybe some of this will be uh, familiar So we have to say... Do we say thank you to Matthew? Yes. I said for Matthew. If I didn't say thank you, thank you, Matthew. I hope that you're on. He sent me a letter a while back and said, uh, you guys got that box from the UK, and uh, you need to try one from the other colony, because Canada and Australia and New Zealand, we're all colonies. We all feel kindred. We all have to have the, the Queen for some apparent reason on our money, even though we're not really associated with the Queen too much anymore. <laughs> we, she's still there. <laughs> Looking, Whoa. watching us on our coins. Okay, there. That was okay. very close to me. Right? So. Okay, hang on. Do you want Should me to I... tilt the camera down? Yeah, maybe. Okay. So I can spill out the goods. Should I just take out one of them? This is very well packed. This is, oh wait. We got a letter. Okay, I'll let you read the letter. Dear Archbold family, hi from Australia. I thought you may enjoy some snacks that were invented in Australia. Oh, the and Anzac. Anzac. Biscuit cookie is one of them. It stands for Australian and New Zealand Army Corps. Corps. Oh. I know. It's, it's like people, it's like the same person <laughs> that came up with the word, the, the name Colonel. It's not how it sounds. He knew. He knew I was going to say it wrong. I, it's really we have, like, we have it pouring. If you guys are wondering what it's doing in Edmonton right now, pouring rain out the window. <laughs> okay, Australian and New Zealand soldiers formed part of the Allied Expedition in World War I. During World War I, the wives, mothers, and girlfriends of the Australian soldiers were concerned for the nutritional value of food being supplied to the troops. Food was transported across the sea at a max speed of 10 knots or 18.5, what's KPA? Kilometer per hour. Kilometers per hour? Yeah. Uh, by ships in, of the Merchant Navy. Mon many of these shops did not contain refrigerated facilities, so any food that was sent had to remain edible for at least two months. Well, that means that no matter when this was sent. So basically, he sent his food that could not possibly go bad as he shipped it to us in the mail. Warning, warning, the Vegemite is not a sweet Oh, spread. Abby, I have a job for you. Uh, I have a friend can of mine that... Can you make four pieces of toast? Oh, yeah. With butter? Yeah. You, can so, you do it? it's funny because I have a friend of mine that came back... Um, where did she go? Where's your mom? Where did your mom go? Well, we had Marmite. New Marmite. Zealand. Yeah. So she brought me back some... Oh, was it Marmite? Marmite. It's kind of the same. Marmite. But I'm we have, we know the thing. trick. <laughs> it's, it's not good. A, if you, uh, it, if you, you are not to you, or use it, a small amount spread lightly on buttered bread or toast would be wise. Thank you so much, Matthew. We really appreciate it. Who's the guy that plays Wolverine? Hugh Jackman. Hugh Jackman brought um, Marmite spread onto like the Jimmy Fallon show or something. I don't know. You guys can look it up later. And they're like, oh, it's going to be disgusting. And then he's like, no, because he smeared it all over the bread. Yeah. And they're like, that's not how you eat it. Yeah. It has to be toasted. Well, we had Marmite, but this is Vegemite. I think it's probably similar. Um, the way that I tried it was on toast with butter and then a, a tiny bit, and then I put nutritional yeast on top. That was actually pretty delicious. I, I, are you reading the comments? Oh, uh, can you handle spicy treats? <laughs> yes, I can. Uh, oh, Alexander's commenting. Alex yes. loves spicy. I had, uh, I, didn't you watch the one where I went out with my... Uh, 
my sister Heather and we stopped at that spicy store and they gave me like the nine million on the spicy scale or whatever. I, I handled it pretty well, I think. The other guy that was there was dancing all around. Um, I do, mind you, maybe now that I'm getting elderly, uh, I won't it's be able fine. to handle the spice. Just put it through. I think it's time we had like That's a good. spice eating contest for me to finally prove. Mm, I don't know. I, I'm the spice. I do food. like spicy though. When we, I don't think they do much for spicy food out in uh, Nova Scotia because I asked for the spiciest chicken wings they had and it was like ketchup on it. They're like, are you sure you can handle this? And I'm like, Steven, it's like it ketchup. ketchup. It's like nothing. Uh, and they told me that was their spiciest sauce. No, it was kind of like barbecue sauce. No, the guess, spiciest but. sauce was Frank's Red Hot. Oh, yeah. look. It's, uh, so I wonder, so now, uh, Matthew, I'm curious if you saw us open the, um, the U.S. Mm -hmm. snacks from Alyssa first because he sent some Arnott's Wagon Wheels. It says the so, original. And it, so, wagon wheels are you know what? Lit. I need to buy some Wagon Wheels to show. I mean, most people. I'm, I shouldn't say most people because that, this is what they have in Australia is Wagon Wheels. Doesn't every Wagon Wheel product say the original Wagon Wheel? It's, it's like I heard a comedian talking about, like, laundry detergent it's always improving like how much better can it possibly there get which is the original wagon wheel the original wagon wheel is actually a wagon wheel that you would just chew on a piece of wood oh, this if this so, is a tiny oh, if i can look, mount this it, on a wagon this is similar it says oh, chocolate coated marshmallow and jam so this is similar to what we have and i'm just gonna watch them eat it but because, because yeah. it's not that i'm uh too good for us somebody <laughs> thought that i th I wasn't eating the American ones last time because I was like, look at this guy. He's too good for American snacks. That's not it at all. I have a sweet tooth like nobody's business. Um, so it's complete self-control that I'm not eating right now. Um, I'm avoiding sugars and stuff like that. Oh, it smells good. I, I'm so sorry for the descriptions. It smells good. <laughs> it does smell good. How's it taste? It out this, like this is better than our wagon wheel in my opinion. Mm-hmm. It's like a... Like, I would order this at, like, a restaurant. What kind of restaurant would you go to that serves wagon wheels on the menu? <laughs> no. Ah, I see the, would you like a nice burgundy to go with the wagon wheels? What do you think it tastes like? Why are they serving my son wine? That's the other question. It doesn't taste like, uh, it doesn't taste like the wagon wheels on. that we can get here. And even our wagon wheels have changed. They made them smaller, and they do taste different, too. Oh, yeah, but, that, the hot sauce I tried was called The End. But it didn't kill was me. Was it? Yeah. So. What's this, the texture like? Uh, there's like, I don't want to show my bite mark. No, I mean like, what's it feel like? But it tastes like crispy kind of cookie on either side. There's sweet marshmallow in the middle and then some jam. The jam tastes like jam. <laughs> it kind of is it raspberry? Like, is it strawberry? I don't is it know what it is. It's, it's like a mixture. It mostly, ma strawberry. mainly can taste the, uh, the cookie and the chocolate, but it's not overly sweet. The marshmallow is the only thing that really gives it a sweetness. And the chocolate's good. Like it doesn't taste like that. Cheap chocolate. <laughs> oh, you okay? Oh, so next we up, <laughs> we actually have these, but ours look different than this. Is all sorts licorice contains real licorice root extract. Contains molasses. Mm. If you guys were wondering what Yum. happened there, Chewy knocked over. No, um, I don't. We don't have jammy dodgers here. Did somebody ask jammy dodgers? Is that oh. when your wife throws a jar of jam at your head look. and you have to dodge it? Hey, look at these. <laughs> oh, the, those look like licorice all sorts, but yeah, massive. It's, yeah, they're, they're, they are licorice all sorts. Oh, I pretty, love licorice oh, all sorts. Oh, they're super soft. Oh. So these. I dipped that one. Oh, no, 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 okay, no, no, you can no, take no. some. I, I showed it, didn't I? Did okay. I just look at it? Sorry, if I just looked at it, read it, and was like, woo, and then didn't show you. I'm excited, oh, you, you guys. Oh, you can take two. That's fine. Here, Steven, you can take one. So, I don't know. If these this are is super painful. soft. Here. I, I, I show it. Here, you can probably not see it moving. I feel like a monster, but it's good. worth it because this is good. Okay, Abby, I'll show the camera what color you picked. My favorite color. Everything she mm -hmm. picks is pink. She's off camera right now, but she goes straight to the pink one. So that is the all sorts brand right there that we're trying. It looks Not really overly good. sweet. I'm so sorry if you guys love all sorts, but these are better. <laughs> In my opinion, they're not overly sweet. They're super chewy and... Mm -hmm. I don't know, they don't, and they're not overly black licorice flavored, even though it has actual black licorice in it. I like that flavor. This is better than that. It's a, like our family, it might also contain mm -hmm. nuts. So Hi. good. Me. I don't know why I put the whole thing in there. Okay. Do you want, want me to talk while you chew? chew? I will talk while she chews. The, the chewing is kind of an up and down with some drooly action happening off the side. <laughs> she can't she can't talk back too much because her mouth is full of licorice all sorts. But would you guys give it a thumbs up? You liked it? 
I would give it two thumbs up. Two thumbs I, I up. don't usually like black licorice, and I liked it. Mm, okay. So next up is Twisties cheese. We don't have this, and if we do, don't I haven't seen it. Do you have to do the twist when you're eating it? Maybe you do the twist while you eat it. it or says, do you have to be cheesy? Because I'm both. It says life's pretty sweet without Twisties cheese. What? Wait, really yeah. quickly, Dad, can you explain? Can you explain what the twist is? I don't. You want me to explain? You have to put, you basically, it's like you put your foot on the ground and you don't move it from that spot and you twist it like like you see somebody who's butting out like a... Didn't you see in, uh, what was that movie where he skipped school? You basically keep your foot, the ball of your foot planted Paris on the ground yeah. and you twist your leg back and forth. You kind of do the thing with the arms and then oh. you move your other leg forward and do that too. Yeah, anyway, so I'm not going to demonstrate because is... we're all sitting down right now. No, I think you should. That's, that's not, the, to that's so not the twist, is, Abigail. This is actually that's made so from, I mean, oh, it's, it's in, made in yeah. Australia by Smith's like Snack this. Food Company. It says okay. open carefully. Is that what it says? Yeah. <laughs> it has like a... Open here, carefully because there's yeah, a snake yeah, in there. Oh! A snake in it kind of smells like those, uh, <laughs> those little cheese crackers, you know? You know, it, no, you know what it smells like when you open up like a box of dog food and you're like, <laughs> yeah. that doesn't smell half bad. <laughs> you're oh. like, I, I would be half tempted to try one of these dog biscuits. I'm sorry, it, it smells like it, nice dog biscuit. It doesn't taste good. It smells like dog food. It does, but <laughs> how does it do taste? It's salty, not super salty. Kind of tastes Basically, like dog food. It's a bit it, fishy. You know what it what does? The fishy? It's not fishy. Uh, I don't know. I don't. It kind of tastes like the cheese off of Kraft dinner. Do you know? I mean, I would probably eat if I was like starving. On no, the it it tastes but like those little it. cheese crackers. <laughs> you know. Oh, like the, the cheese ones. Do you guys remember the little crackers you'd get, and it had the just cheese and little red plastic stick, and you'd have to scoop no, it in and spread. Like I'm, gonna take I'm just asking if they remember those. I used to get those in my lunch at school. Or the peanut butter ones before peanut butter this, killed everybody. This tastes <laughs> like something that you're like, I don't know if I like this, but you end up finishing the whole bowl. They're super crispy, like, uh, what are these ones? Not the pasta. Oh, they're, they're basically uh, like Cheetos. Abby, you gotta come sit. The smell of it. I'm back. It's like really strong. Abby was smell. making toast because she's getting ready for the Vegemite. Vegemite. It does not smell good, but it tastes... No, it doesn't like, smell good, but... I mean, it's like, like, it's... It smells like mouse a little bit, like <laughs> like mouse, mouse. Like, Maybe there or was a mouse um, in a like really old mouse. hamster hamster cage. Yeah, hamster cage. That's what but it, it smells like. But it doesn't taste bad. One of the Dear Twisties, <laughs> you guys, this is Im so Cadbury. Are you still reading comments? <laughs> no, I'm just trying to give some constructive criticism to Twisties. Um, first off, I can imagine your commercial lights pretty straight without Twisties, and somebody eats it, and they start like spinning around or something. Um, they don't spell the bag probably in the commercial because it'd be like, hey guys, you want some twisties? Uh, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Was it dog food? No, it wasn't dog food. Try it. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> um, oh. Maybe it's an acquired taste. I'm not going to try one because I'm only going off Ooh. the smell here. That well, I mean, it doesn't taste bad. Our so dog, it doesn't taste it's bad, it's just the smell smells like Chewy. hamster. Yeah. Chewy is <laughs> like lingering around yeah, because of the smell of twisties. Hamster. So Cadbury, this one's a Cadbury product from Australia, and it has a little koala on the front. So what is it Carmella, called? A Carmelo koala, a dairy milk. It's well, made from real koala droppings. Well, like, I'll eat it. <laughs> it's like the Easter Bunny, but for Australia. <laughs> <laughs> These are pretty. The koala. That's the oh, they come in little self packaging. Yeah, I'm not, uh, Jenny, I'm not being a scaredy cat. I'm avoiding carbs and sugars mm. because I'm trying to. They come in these oh. little well, packages. Is it melted? I'll still eat it like this. It was warm today. Oh, yeah. Wait, look at the mm. things, things about it. Was it one shaped like a koala? I, I mean, My I get it anyways. Ears, like... I can't even see a koala mm -hmm. shape. It's like oh. melted dead koala bear. I'll we'll put them in the. We'll just it put good? it. Is it like a Cadbury? Kind of uh, like a caramel. What's the chocolate mm -hmm. like? The chocolate looks lighter than It's like than caramel. Oh, chocolate that's what it is. Milk. It's caramel. It's just in the shape of a koala. Where's the messy koala? We're going to put fridge. them in the fridge. I am... It was hot today. I am really into chocolates, so this is hard for me. Um, <laughs> if you guys have ever had caramel where, you know... It just looks like they're, they're like individual little, they're not individual, it's a bar that you it can break in into too. squares and it has the caramel in the middle. How do they get the caramel the into the caramel part? The little one's coming too, and then it's just caramel on it. You're welcome. Yeah. Looks good, smells good. Let me it's smell good. your breath. Ew. Mm. Okay, you guys, this is I the just end. I fish crackers. These are the end yeah. back. 
Biscuits. I'm sorry if I'm butchering that. I think they're Hands it's out. reversed Hands in that thing. I need my water. Just imagine it's no his. artificial. It says oh, Australia's authentic recipe. People were forced to eat them during the war and they liked them so much that now they buy them on purpose. I see those Tim Tams over there. We can get that here. And I know I really like them. They look like they're survival biscuits. It kind of looks like those uh, baby biscuits, you know, that you can... Oh, no, it doesn't. It looks like a dad's cookie. Oh, well, it does yeah. look like a cookie. It looks like... I don't know if you guys have dad's oatmeal cookies, but that's what it looks like. Thank you. I'm always first. Lucky. Yay, I was second to Yay. Okay. I'm going to watch the mead. It smells like a dad's cookie. Yeah. It is a dad's cookie. Mm -hmm. Except without chocolate chips. And Aznak spelled backwards is... Cause nah! In Canada, spelled backwards is Adenac. It's and a little bit different. There used to be an Adenac Dry, like there's Canada Dry. There used to be a drink called Adenac Dry too. Go figure. These are good. This is gonna go well with coffee. I thought that it was gonna be very uh, dry. I mean, it's a cookie. It's dry. Is it sweet? Mm -mm. Well, a little bit sweet, but it's like. Mine's pretty it's sweet. So would it be good it, with tea? Maybe? Yeah. It tastes yeah. like mm. it tastes exactly like a dad's cookie, but slightly more coconut. -y. I think this would be. Perfect for tea. It's like a, it wouldn't, like, a crispy co uh, coconut Actually, I don't know. oatmeal cookie. I feel like that would go nicely paired with an Earl Grey. Right in there. Mm -hmm. mm. Yes. Oh. Okay, we got to do the Vegemite before the toast gets cold. Okay. Yeah. Chewy. I Can will try grab... one bite of Vegemite toast. Could you grab um, butter knife, butter knife, please? This is a fair tube of it, too. I'm sorry, the butter did not melt very well. That's okay. It, a chunk of butter will help. Okay. At least there was no spray cheese this time. <laughs> and everybody's like, spray cheese oh. is the best. I'm not convinced of that. I think the best suggestion was somebody said that they had nachos and then they filled in all the holes with the spray cheese. I thought, oh, mm. that's a lot of cheese, first off. I wonder if you could do that with permed hair. <laughs> Fill in all the holes with spray cheese. I'm 90% sure that spray cheese is So I've learned that people are very defensive over their spray cheese. I, I have got told. <laughs> It tasted like Kraft Singles mashed right. up like with lighter fluid. Yeah. Isn't Vegemite like... part of like a a Men at <laughs> Work opinion. song or something? It smells like molasses. It doesn't smell bad. It kind of has like a chocolatey um, molasses taste. Molasses. What, okay, what you song? What Here's a trivia question is? for everybody. What song has Vegemite in it? Oh. From like the 1980s. So uh, I'm putting on um, a fair... Looks like a little mouse drop. And I hope somebody answers because it's going to drive me crazy. What did you ask? What was it called? Uh, what song has Vegemite in it? I come from the land down under, yes. Who is that? Is that Men at Work? Did I get it right the first time around? Wow. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try the same bite. It, or oh, yeah. I'm only gonna give, hate Now give me bite. a bite of your Vegemite sandwich. Yeah, okay. Uh, see, I got it. Wow. Because it said, okay, do you want the, so, this one? Yeah. It tastes a little bit evil. looks like this. It tastes evil. <laughs> she, she put a little schmear on there. I put a little dot, and then I'm mixing it with the butter and on the toast. I might have still put too much on. Did I? <laughs> Probably. Sorry. Wait, I'm not gonna eat the crust though. Just take a bite. The crust is nothing more than the handle for the bread. <laughs> unless it's unless it's stuffed crust pizza. I might have put too much on. Yeah, that's good. I'm coughing out of. Okay. It There's tastes water. musky. It tastes musky. <laughs> I don't need to try I'm it. I'm kind of oh. done. And I'm trying it. Maybe I'll just take a piece of butter. I mean, it would be good if there's less on here. It's salty. It's gross. <laughs> You're mean. I might have put too much on. Abiel, not a big fan. I don't mind it. It's How a little on salty side. I think I didn't have it. No, after I watched them choking and stuff, I put less on mine. Somebody said Vegemite oh, wow. and cream cheese. Mm -hmm. Wait, hang on. I can kind of Do imagine Do you want to try that. it again? Abiel, grab me a spoon. I'm going to try a spoon. Okay. No, Vegemite. Go get me a spoon, babe. No. Okay, That's, go get Somebody get me a spoon. No, why don't you choose? I don't want to watch I'm doing you, this like, for all of the colonies. For the queen on our coins. I don't want to watch if you, you puke, die. You have for the polar puke. bears on the other Please, side. Do not puke Look, it says it has, it doesn't have vitamin B, it has B vitamins. Is that like It's the, actually, it's not, it's supposed to be not Don't take bad. too much, it's really. Yeah, you got me a gross spoon. Right? I, I feel like that's not, shouldn't be your worry. Just Can you just go get another spoon that, quick? Uh, <laughs> that's his worry. I, no, I don't know where she thing. found the spoon. I found it in the Gross. Floor. That spoon was slimy. You probably put it in. So how much do I put on it? Like, not a it. mounded spoonful. Oh, okay. then just much. She got me a tablespoon on it. It's a good squirt of Vegemite on there. Squirt. It is. Squirt is what squirt. he's going to be doing later. let me make the face that they would make in the Vegemite commercial. And I'll do it. Somebody said Australian commercials are low-key, not like American commercials. So it'll be like this. Vegemite. It's when you have nothing else in your pantry. 
<laughs> it's satisfying. His teeth are black. Just take your water, drink your it down. Don't oh. think about it. Wait. I need my water just from looking at that. Ooh. Like that. And? Ah. <laughs> okay, it's slimy. It's, it came in a two. No, they don't recommend doing that. Oh. It's what? what I, it's, I imagine this is what it would taste like if I cleaned my barbecue grill off after a year with my teeth. <laughs> and like scraped all that black gunk into my face in the sludge. It sticks to the roof of your mouth. It that sticks. Was your fault. Drink your water. It won't go away. It. For anybody leaving comments that we're missing, I actually do read the comments after, I swear. Okay. I like crumble. It's the, it's the okay. way it shatters that matter. Okay, you guys. This one I've is I've never met that oh. man in my life. Lifesavers. Oh. Right, can you make sure you're oh, the too. comments too? <laughs> <laughs> just a little. <laughs> just a sec. No, it's right in my face. <laughs> Why? Mm -hmm. We're trying to do a taste test here. Chewy's freaking out. <laughs> We're not gonna be just happy with the new dog. It's oh, breath is pretty awful. Black black can you just like tape your mouth shut, maybe? <laughs> That's not very nice. I love you. Give me a kiss, Mama. No. No, she would do it. <laughs> That's true love. She kissed Vegemite face. I've kissed the <laughs> So this one's called Lifesavers. I'm a little bit concerned because the flavor is called musk. You could, if you don't like it, you could fill the holes of your Lifesaver with Vegemite. <laughs> <laughs> like little pastry chef. Oh, look. He says they're still like. Give it to your neighbors. Yeah, it'll be like hey, the cream filling. Give it to filling. the people so, you hate. We could fill a donut with this and give it out at a, like a class party. No. Okay. So <laughs> these Lifesavers look kind of like smoothies. Like, oh, I'm, I'm looking at it. Hooray. It's, I want to try the flavor. It's musk musk. flavored. It smells like perfume. I should have smelled it. I hope it's not you, short for Exactly musk. like, what's that? Musk? Thrills. Oh, Thrills, thrills gum. gum. What's Her mom likes Thrills gum. It's funny that it's called musk, because I would buy a cologne that says musk, but I don't know that I'd buy a Fruit Loop Here, or like a lifesaver that says oh. cologne. It is and thrills. And it tastes like soap. Oh, it smells like musk. It actually. Now you got one, but sure. It did I give you two? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who didn't get one? Jason, did you try the Vegemite? Somebody's asking, did you get out of it somehow? Yeah, I got out of it. Oh, he's only after the candy. You guys um, are right. No, he tastes, didn't. He didn't get out of it. Kind of tastes mm -hmm. like bath bomb. No, you can't pour <laughs> it. It tastes like girl's yeah. gum. You know, this is embarrassing to admit, but there was a time. It's not terrible. It just is not. I actually know what bath bomb tastes like. I told oh, you. Oh, yeah. Did you? Yeah. I'm pretty sure we heard the story. I, yeah. I came home. Alexander met me at the door, and he said, what did you, you were like, what was with the candies in the drawer? Like, what are you talking Sorry. about? And then he brought out this baggie of the tiny little bath bombs that I had. So I knew, I could imagine what had happened to him. So I guess he'd put it in his mouth. It looked like gourmet candy in a little bag. Good. And it smelled like this stuff. It smelled like, it smelled like soap, but just enough like candy that I was, it was worth the risk. So in it went. And when you put a bath bomb in your mouth, <laughs> There's no just, oh, that was odd and take you out because it explodes out of your face. And sucks all the moisture out of your body. It sucks all, yeah, dries your whole face off like oh, a shrunken head. Oh, I already started, I already started uh, opening this. This is called Violet Crumble, and it looks like a chocolate bar. It kind of looks like it's going to be our chocolate bar that's called Crunchy. crunchy. Oh, like not. it has, um... Oh, well, look. Oh, yeah, the kind of toffee, nougat stuff inside. you see where I put the knife? It's right here. The way it shatters, that matters. Is that what it says? Yeah, it says that on the side. So is it shatters that matters? It's gonna, oh, yeah. Oh, it's a little crunchy. different. Yeah, oh, it's just, to um, Wait, show it to the camera what sponge. the inside looks like. Yeah, it's like it, toffee. It's like sponge, sponge toffee. Except it's not. like, so it's mm. like our crunchy, but I don't know. I it like those It too. smells like sponge toffee, if you know what that is. I look forward to eating this one. I'll mm. also mm. eat another I one. I like crunchy. Does it taste like it? It's like crumbly, like sand. So we, it's not like... We've never been to Australia. I do have an uncle in Australia. Maybe. Steven likes the been. soap. Uh, I do too. You guys Life like flavor. the uh, musk? Too. They're not like called soap flavored. It musk. It tastes like perfume. Like somebody sprayed it near my face. <laughs> it tastes no. like or smells like? No, the tastes like. That's all I can taste. Oh. I'm telling you, it tastes just like okay. bath bomb. This one. What That's did good. I say this was called? Mm -hmm. It's like sponge toffee, but kind of coffee flavored. Kind of. I don't know mm -hmm. how I would describe it. It's like sponge toffee, but not. It's like crunchy, but easier to eat. We in Canada have really been missing out. 
Because I've just learned by reading the back of the Vegemite container that this is essential for brain function. That's because it's vitamin B. <laughs> but it's essential for brain function. I should just be taking this whole tube right now, I think. I think you should too. No, please do not. Yeah, it supports, it supports, no, do you trust me. You don't want a piece of that, boy. I'm gonna wait until I'm- this, uh, We're just gonna put the, this one in the freezer for a minute. Can you just put it in the I freezer while we try the other one? one? This is what they give cops well, when they're like five one, months from retirement. And he's like, I've only got five months to go. Then it's Tahiti for me on vacation. And then he gives them the Vegemite and the guy dies on the spot. And they're like, oh no, that was the worst cop movie ever. We have two more chocolate ones that I have to put in the freezer because they become liquid. Oh, I it's forgot really to see what we're gonna have. Here. So these ones are chocolate Tim Tams. And we've had these because we have a section in our grocery store that stocks Australian and UK treats. But I haven't seen the Violet Crumble before and the wagon wheels. Actually, I haven't seen any of these except for this one. Okay. But I would look for Anzac again. Open it on up. Uh, is Astro Pop Sucker the one that's like all the different colors, like the, the red, the white, the blue? Uh, Rebecca's right. asking, maybe she'll tell me. I think so. So I'm a genius are, when it comes to that. This is like our, our like hot day today, so all of our- It's super warm and there's Everything probably some known to- There's a mild possibility of tornadoes later today. That would be Not awesome. Not here. Yeah, Somewhere. here. Somewhere. Oh, so here. It, here. this is a bad representation. <laughs> so imagine this isn't melting over my hand. Yeah, I'll take it's that. I'll take that off your hand. Covered in chocolate. I can't remember what's I'll in the middle. I'll take the next one off your hand. Oh, it's, it's really melted. I know. Do you guys remember going to the store and getting just like, it was like a tube of wax with some mildly flavored candy fluid on the inside I and you just chew yeah, the wax. Yeah, they still make those. Oh, mom. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah, yeah. They still I, make I remember that. Why do we eat wax? What can't, have they figured out the wax. You're I know, but them. still you chew it in your mouth, right? No. Um, this is melting, look at No, this. I'm serious. There was one that you had to like oh, chew no. on. Oh, mm no. -hmm. Abigail's making a horrible mess. <laughs> I don't know. And she's it's... sitting on me. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Here's my napkin. We it used to like, go to uh It tastes like a crispy chocolate cookie covered in milk chocolate. Okay? Mm -hmm. Is it good? They're not very sweet. Yeah, they're I good. I've, I've bought them before. I actually put them in the freezer. Your hands look like you just changed a dirty diaper. Um. Ah, show the camera. <laughs> 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 yeah, no. Mm -hmm. It's really oh. melting. So that looks good. Should we see if the other ones are... No, we just put them in the freezer. In the meantime, can I have another one? No, they're talking about the wax sticks online. Right? No, not those, no. not those. We don't talk about those. I don't even, why, I, why would I even go there and be like, I've got five cents of my name that's going to wax that might taste like something. Maybe it's because they were colored and they looked interesting. Um, I remember the Neapolitan toffee too, that you peel the wax off. And I used to buy these mystery bags and it had packages of wacky packages in them or sometimes garbage pail kids, which was always a letdown for me. I was more of a wacky package kind of guy. Um, good times though. Yeah, now you have a whole bunch. So we did just come back from Halifax and PEI, and both of our vlogs will be coming out. You didn't put your holiday vlog out already. No, no, I did just like a proper, case. like, what what's it like in uh, in Nova Scotia? I know Prince a lot Edward of people, Island. so on Alex Satter's channel, I noticed that they're like, okay, why are you always just working? You should have been holidaying. But that was such a small portion of our holiday, the pics. Yeah. We actually had an actual holiday and it was pretty amazing. So you'll we'll have to stay tuned for both of our vlogs on that. Coming soon to your device, whichever you're well, watching. Well, we just got on. home yesterday. Was yesterday our first day back? Our full day back. Our full day back, yeah. I had a long day at work yesterday. Yeah, too. it was hard. It's only three hours difference and it's later there, but that was the first time we've been to Germany before and that's eight hours difference and I didn't have yeah. as hard of time with that as I did with... Um, well, well I think, oh, is there one more to go? No, there's two more. We're just letting the other one freeze a little bit. So this one's called Cherry Ripe, and it's also by Cadbury. <gasps> super shiny. It's super gooey. <laughs> just no, this was a la this is a least melted one. Like we had that in the freezer already. But it was only in there for like I'll two be minutes. Like that. Yeah. Oh, okay. Ooh, it looks so cherry like on the inside. It has, I'm sure that's not what it's supposed to look like because we're dealing with some melted chocolate. It, it smells it's good. It's been warm here. Hold on, let's see. Smells delicious. You might eat this. Yeah, that's a good idea. You that's just grab like all of them. Yep. Abigail is so prepared and responsible. Here, Jason. Is it, so what is it like? So it's, oh, I just, you don't want to Okay, so the, what does it taste like? I'm not even there Probably yet. I don't know, it's really good. It's got a weird texture though. And like, about, like melty chocolate? Like <laughs> melted chocolate, yeah. Weird like Vegemite, a spoonful of Vegemite. <laughs> 
I'll actually do that right now. Mm -mm. No, no, don't. You trust mm. me. I'm gonna sniff this. Stay away licorice? from the Vegemite. Yeah. It's dangerous stuff. Uh, <laughs> you know what it is? No. It's like coconut on the inside. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's it's cherry flavored coconut. Nope, Stephen. Stephen <laughs> likes it. He's trying to go back for more. Cherry flavored <laughs> coconut in the middle, and then in chocolate. You know what I noticed with these chocolates? Is they're not super sweet because my throat's not closing up at all. But they're delicious. Like it's not. That one was a little bit sweet. For anybody that doesn't like coconut, it's like a hint of coconut. See? Or is it? Like this is somebody saying it is coconut in there. Yeah, it is coconut. Yeah. It's cherry flavored coconut. It's like right. a coconut nougat. Okay, we need the very last one. one. I got the last one. I was pleased with that one. We'll see if it just runs. Stephen tried going back for more, so he must like it. The last one was really melted. I should have put these in the. I I've never opened a box and actually had it nice enough that it, we've had melted problems. This one was not melted. Mm. <laughs> okay. So it's a little bit. Okay, so these ones are also dairy milk. Free friends, Cadbury. Well, you gotta show them. I know, but I needed to read it. Is it flavored like the animal? Oh, I want the one that tastes like hedgehog. <laughs> it's not a hedgehog. What are those called? The. Uh, no, it's not a porcupine. We don't have them here. I don't know, but I wonder if it uh, tastes like I'm it. guessing these are all animals from Australia. Like. Furry friends. Wallaby, whatever that. It's a large rodent, no. the largest rodent. I forgot what that was no, called. The, no, I can't remember what that, that is. We're going to split this one, and then the other ones can go in there. Time, kids. It's made with real wallaby. Yay! So we're going to eat the kangaroo. Oh, it says on the bottom. <laughs> Sorry, Yum. kangaroo. It says kangaroo. No, platypus. Oh, oh, echidna. Let's eat somebody the said kangaroo. Oh, yeah, now I we think need it to know is. what that other animal is. I think they're right. I think it's this. I thought it was like the other one. The other one was a wombat. Then... With fun flavors like wombat. Oh, it is wombat. Again. No, this one. Oh, they're all melted. I know. This, they were really melted. It's like before. liquid. Echidna. Yeah, this yeah they're right. Echidna. There we go. Echidna. We probably right. didn't say it right. Echidna. Kind of a cute little thing. So it's not supposed to look like this, Let's but that. that's what we're. That's as good as it gets. Oh look! Okay. Oh oh no! no it kind of has a work. <laughs> it's kind of melted, folks. Well, Melissa, you no, just try a little piece. Okay, I'm gonna try a little piece, and then we'll. I I'll don't really think you need to. That's cut right. It. I don't. I don't it's need like it. Cutting I do. Mm -mm. Is it? Is it good? Mm -hmm. It's good. Is it sweet? That's all you're giving us. Well, we'll put these in the freezer for a while, and we'll give them with the kids later. It kind of tastes like chocolate. chocolate. <laughs> I'm gonna take another. Um, this one tasted more like the sweet chocolate, like regular Cadbury's. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. Steve, Steve, can you go put these back in the freezer? Don't oh, wait, I've got one more. We, we have to get it back when it looks like a wombat again. All right. And then okay. I want to see what the design and everything is. So all in all, that was pretty delicious. What was your favorite, Abigail? Um, <laughs> I don't... <laughs> was it the Vegemite? Was it the hamster cake? <laughs> Which one? Hamster cake um, girls? I think it would be not the twirling cheese, but maybe the toffee thing. Oh, the chocolate filled yeah, toffee. Yeah, the violet crumble. Okay, so, Stephen, what about you? <laughs> it no longer looks very appetizing. I'm going to say the cherry stuff. The cherry chocolate, yeah. Jason, what about cherry, you? Right? I like coconut. Uh, the crumble one. You went back for another cookie, though, or biscuit. No, you guys don't help yourselves, please. Mm. Uh, my favorite was probably... Maybe, I think maybe the, the cookie as well. The, the Anzac? Anzac. There you go. Military made and But this is delicious. actually, I'll actually eat this. I will not. <laughs> it's good for our brain function. <laughs> well, I eat a lot. I don't eat as Make much brain meat. tingle. So I'm not sure what B, B vitamins, but if it's B12. Oh, it says B1, 2, and 3. And Did you hear that the Beyond Meat burgers are essentially the same product as dog food? No, you didn't. Yeah, it well, says I that... Beyond Meat Burgers is essentially all the same ingredients they put in some dog food. I had a Beyond, a Beyond Meat Burger um, from a and I think, right? Yeah. And it was so convincingly, uh, like with all of their, uh, uh, all of the toppings on it, it was so convincingly meat that I was mad that they gave me a beef burger. What I didn't like about it, so it tastes just like meat for anybody that's thinking about getting it. It does actually taste like meat if it's prepared properly. Otherwise, it tastes like a veggie burger. But the, the thing that I didn't like about it is that it gave you that same feeling of a fast food burger where it's kind of like you don't feel so great after, like you thought it was going to be a good idea, but you go away feeling like, oh, it just hurt my, hurt my arteries. <laughs> Are you writing people? She's being cute underneath yes. the table. But yeah, so everybody picked a favorite. 
And were there any questions or anything? No, they're just, oops. I, I hit the button before that went out there. I was saying that you're, um, you're mainly vegetarian, but she'll sometimes eat chicken. Yeah, my, but I still eat eggs and everything like that. I'm not a picky vegetarian, though. You're not I'll a make, vegan. No, but I mean, I'm, I'm not a picky vegetarian. I, well, first off, I eat chicken, so that's, and poultry. So you're not a vegetarian. No. Yeah. So more videos coming soon. Veggie yeah, we have uh, our PEI in Halifax videos coming up. I have uh, the <laughs> unboxing of the jewelry, and if you thought this was really explaining everything well, just wait till I explain jewelry that we found in Mary's house. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Thank you all very much, and thank you guys for tasting all the snacks, you guys. What should we say to Matthew? Thank you. Thank very much. Much. Uh, and what should we say to Mike? This Thanks. is Matthew. Oh, is it Matthew? Oh, okay. I thought it was, oh yeah, it is Matthew. I thought his name was Mike. I'm like, oh. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> I remember it because that's Stephen's middle name. <laughs> yeah. But thank you so very much. We appreciate uh, all of the treats and snacks that'll go to good use <laughs> once I get it back in its solid form. And thank you to everybody that came along today and, and uh, watched this with us. So if you want us to try anything too, even if you put in the comments things that you think that we should try, I'll try to pick some up and maybe we can do a taste test on that as well. But I can never remember how to turn it off. Thank you again, you guys. Have a great night. Have a good night, guys. See you soon. Bye.